students of the Donetsk National University celebrated their first day of university in Vinnytsia for the fourth year in a row. Five years ago, it was evacuated from the occupied city, and this year, 1,500 students will attend classes. I made a conscious choice. I see my future, and I strive for knowledge. 7,000 people have already graduated from the Donetsk University in Vinnytsia. The first few years, most of the students were IDPs. Today, though, only every 10th student is from the Donbass. The number of IDP students has dropped because of the lack of accommodation and distance from home. The university itself still does not have dormitories. This is why prospective students are mostly from the Vinnytsia and nearby regions. I chose international relations because it offers great prospects and many opportunities. 16 regions of Ukraine have sent students here. Only 15 came from the temporarily occupied territories. Students will attend lectures in the former Kristall Jewelry Factory Workshop. The director shows the university flag that was brought to Vinnytsia from Donetsk. 70% of our professors are with us today and continue working in Vinnytsia. None of them thought they would have to stay in Vinnytsia this long. We were expecting that the war will end and we will come back home. We thought of it as a waiting period. We were still working. We had to graduate our students who moved with us. Despite all the complications, the university has already made a development plan towards 2025. Among the main priorities are dorms. Reported by Arina Kanyostiva, UATV.